What is up, YouTube? I'm tired, but today's a good day. I'm getting ready to go pick up my buddy Lloyd. We're gonna drive all the way to Anchorage. It's like an hour and a half from here one way. And we are going to go pick up another sled. Looks really, really nice in the pictures. The price is right. And I like some of the stuff that comes with it. I don't know if I'm gonna keep it. I think I have some deals in the works, which I'll kind of explain later in the video. But uh, yes, I am making deals for stuff before I even have the stuff, right? Because that's, that's how we do it. And uh, so, yeah, stay tuned. I'll show you guys what we get here in just 10 seconds, I guess, as far as video time goes. Check this thing out. Crazy. I think this is 94 or 95. What year is this? Has it got a manufacture date? Model number, serial number. Yep, it's 94. That says 1993. So it's a 94 model, super sport. This thing is super, like, pretty nice. Not perfect. Got a little something there. No tears up here though. Windshield's busted. It has 1,000 miles on it, almost 1,100. This is old lady owned. She had it for 20 plus years, she says. And uh, she just never rode it. So she put it up for sale and it was a rat race to see who could get this thing first. And I jumped on it right away. Got a cover on the headlight. Can't really see it. And it came with a new old stock shorty white windshield. Brand new in the bag. It's got electric start, but no battery. Just look how nice that fucking foil is on the hood. She's dirty from sitting, I'll tell you that much, but I'm excited to see if this thing will even run. They said it needs work because it's been sitting not because it was broke it's just been sitting for years um i haven't even pulled it over yet i just put some premix fuel in it and we're gonna go ahead and yank on this thing see if she'll fire up No! All right. But I did get it starting on that one pull. And you're like, 10 pulls, damn it. Yeah, it took like 10 pulls and she fired up. I was hoping it'd be like five, but it's been sitting for years. So I had a completely primed fuel system, I'm sure. But I bought this for like, I paid $400. And it's pretty nice. It's not perfect, but it's pretty nice. Fires right up. God damn. I'm afraid to even sit on the seat because I don't want to rip it. But yeah, this is uh, pretty freaking sweet. Too bad these super sports don't have the same style hood as like my 700. And the intake and everything's different. And yeah, also slight difference over here, pipe clearance. But this thing's sweet. I'd say I'm going to keep this one, but honestly, it's kind of a bartering chip. <laughs> so I'm going to keep this uh, new old stock, little pro white windshield. I'm going to steal this here headlight cover. And uh, I'm going to trade this thing off for something I know a lot of people have been bugging me to do. And it's kind of like the XC700, it's rival from back in the 90s. 
and it's another 700 class sled and it's a Polaris so that's pretty much tell you guys at least the general idea of what I'm going to be trying to trade this little sweetheart of a super sport for yeah I can't believe how nice it is nothing fancy it's got electric start no battery though so I didn't try it but this foot thing man it's fucking nice I'm not even gonna lie I kind of wish I'd keep it just for I don't even know what but <laughs> somebody I know likes these fan cooled a lot more than I do and they're willing to trade me some pretty sweet stuff for it so stay tuned for that